Hello Aries! Heather here from the Crystal Vein Tarot here to do your weekly reading for May 25th through to the 31st. So this is a general reading and as a general reading the messages are not going to resonate for everyone so be sure to check out your moon and rising sign readings as well. So today I'm using the Tarot Grand Lux. I have pulled one card for the week and I'm also reading the bottom of the deck for the overall energy around you. And for the weekly card, I'm using a clarifier. I'm using the Archangel Power Tarot card as the clarifier. And as usual, I am wrapping up the reading or concluding the reading with an Animal Speak room. So Aries. Okay, so we have the Four of Coins here. And it is being clarified by the Three of Michael. Okay, so that's a little bit of a heavy energy there. And at the bottom of the deck, though, we have the Ten of Cups, and this is a very positive card, and this is the overall energy for you. So it's nice to see, especially with this Three of Michael. Now, the Three of Michael is just a clarifier, though. And then we have, as your animal speaker in, we have the Wolf, which is about guidance. Okay, Aries. So the Ten of Cups, the Ten of Cups represents... Um, cups is emotional energy, so things that emotionally fulfill you. Tens are completions of a cycle. So this is about family contentment, um, having total love and support around you and being supported by those around you that care about you. And just feeling very complete and fulfilled in that area of your life. Like just, again, emotional fulfillment or having the support of others around you and knowing that you can rely on others. And I'm saying it like that because you do have this Three of Michael here, which can indicate some kind of a sting or a loss that you're still feeling and um, healing from. So you have the Ten of, or sorry, you have the um, Four of Coins here as your weekly card. And the Four of Coins, Coins pent is Pentacles energy, um, Earth energy, physical energy. So. It usually translates to your lendables or your assets, so physical, tangible things that you can touch, hold, feel, things like money, possessions, can also be your physical body, so your health, can also be your physical location where you live, so your home. Um, and But it really translates into what makes you feel safe, secure, and stable, the three S's. Um, that's the, the overall pentacles or coins energy is anything that makes you feel safe, secure, and stable. So that can also be emotions. So your relationships, because relationships can make you feel safe, secure, and stable, especially with this 10 of cups here. Um, that would be an energy that's making you feel safe, secure, and stable, or balanced in some kind of way, because it's family contentment and total love and support. And again, that would make you feel safe. Now you have the four of coins here, and, and it's, this can be a desire for long-term security or stability. Usually translates again into the money, your possessions, but anything that makes you feel safe, secure, and stable. And you want to hold on tightly. Like, so you see he's he's got his chest full of coins here and he's gripping that coin closely. Part of this card is also about trusting the universe that, trusting in the reciprocity of the universe about giving and receiving. It can indicate if you're overspending that you need to not spend so much and watch your pennies. Or on the other hand, maybe you do need to spend more and be a little more relaxed with your money. So it can indicate that for so for So some of you it's going to resonate that way, but in others it's gonna be more about emotions. And I say that because the three of Michael and you have the cups here the Ten of Cups. So for some of you, this could be you desiring emotional balance, emotional stability, um, long-term security in your relationship sector. Again, relationships are pretty broad. It can be romantic to children, to parents, to siblings, to aunts, uncles, close friendships, even your colleagues and your work relationships as well. It's being clarified by the Three of Michael. So the Three of Michael is about you releasing the past because you've experienced some kind of loss or heartbreak. When I say heartbreak, it doesn't mean necessarily that a right relationship has ended. It could just be something. So this is more if you're looking at, especially in the monetary side of the coins, um, this could be where you've invested your heart and soul into something and it didn't pan out quite the way you were hoping it would. And you're suffering from that loss. You're feeling it acutely like that. 
But the Three of Michael does tell you that you will grow and learn from the situation and that time will heal that wound. Um, but, you know, because of this wound, this could be why you're either looking for financial security or you're looking for that emotional security or stability, that safety in that. But do know with this Ten of Cups here that you have it. Whether or not this is this plays out um, money career finance for some of you could even be in your health wellness and spirituality or it could be in your relationship sector you have the support of others around you you also have the wolf which is about guidance and the wolf it it's um it tells you to listen to and trust your own intuition. And by doing so, the wolf becomes your guardian and your guide. That your communications are stronger now and people will respond to your leadership more strongly right now in this week. The, your communication, the communications of others become clearer to you and you will recognize undertones and body signals that may not reflect what you are actually hearing. So you are to trust your impressions at these times. Um, there's also changes that could be occurring around you that haven't shown themselves yet in the physical world. So trust your inner guidance in finding your own new path and in taking control of your life. There will be guidance and protection as you take up your new journeys. And that guidance and protection is going to come from um, that your friends and family and those that really and truly care about you, Aries. So Aries, this concludes your reading for the week of May 25th through to the 31st. I hope you enjoyed this reading. Be sure to like, share, subscribe, click on that notification bell so you're notified when the next readings are available. Aries, have a fantastic week and take care.